We're going to visualize the reality of the world we want to be in. I want you to find a comfortable spot, quiet, all right? I want you to sit down or either lay down. Set a timer for five minutes and close your eyes, uninterrupted. Start by visualizing the ideal performance space that you see in your mind. Is it a field? Are you in an arena? Are you in a stadium? Are you in your church? Are you at your school? Whatever you visualize, that is the reality that you're setting for yourself. What does it sound like? What color are the walls? What color are the seats, the stadium seats? Watch your fans slowly fill into the space. Listen to their excitement. Picture yourself backstage calmly waiting to perform for your audience who's excited to see you perform, who came to hear you sing, see you dance, watch you perform for them. Once you set the scene, remain quiet in that moment until your timer has gone off. That's all it takes. Try it a couple times this week. I have this rule when I'm manifesting something is that you don't tell other people your your manifestations mm. so that they don't put negative energy into it. The evil eye, that's yeah. what we call it, or that's what the Israelis or the Middle right. Easterns call it. Tell me about your ma what you manifested for yourself. Um, I just wanted my song to go well. I didn't really manifest, oh, I wanted to be like, you know, like I want a certain view, view on oh. YouTube or anything like that. I just wanted it to do well. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to see, I wanted people to see that I, I can be a good artist like because people think like TikTok is a cringe app and you can't really <laughs> start a musical career from that app but no like you can actually start a music career at anywhere if mm. you just do it right and just put like your passion into it it'll work out so if you go back to like let's say when you were a kid did you manifest back then what did you first start manifesting um I I only started manifesting last year, actually. Oh, oh. I thought this was like a big part <laughs> of who you are. Um, it's funny because it, um, I didn't know anything about manifestation. Um, beginning of last year, I downloaded TikTok. And the first video was a uh, manifestation talk or whatever. Oh, no what? <laughs> yeah, so that was my first video. And I was like, oh, this is interesting. And then it was basically a video talking about, oh, you should start manifesting. And this is... I better simple start ways. manifesting. That should work for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So what is manifesting as you understand it? Um, it's basically just um, wishing or believing that what you want is going to happen. Mm. Yeah. Do you? Ha is there? Is it more complicated, or is there like more s steps or process? Like, do you have to like visualize it? Do you have to like like? Is there a process to manifesting something? Um, uh, mine's very simple. I just write three things on like my white. Like I have a whiteboard in front of my bed, and mm. I see it first thing in the morning, and last thing before I go to bed at night. So it's just like three things, and when one of those three things are done, like if it came true, I just put another one in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know that's kind of a great idea, though. Yeah, because it's like keeps your mind focused on like these specific goals. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. When you focus on something, you're going to get it done. I actually started manifesting and then because of TikTok. And that's where I started doing the, the three things, <laughs> like the three manifestations. Mm.